News of Philip and Nancy Garrido's confession was nothing short of stunning. It is sending shockwaves throughout Placerville, where the two kidnapping suspects are being held. News 10's Cornell Bernard is live at the El Dorado County Jail with the very latest for us tonight. Dale and Christina, it is the bombshell confession which has everyone talking tonight. This jail has been home to Philip and Nancy Garrido for a long time. Attorneys say the confession motiv motivated by hope that Nancy could one day go free. Philip and Nancy Garrido appear at a brief hearing Monday. Philip looks relaxed. He winks at his wife, even says, I love you. Some speculate a recent meeting with sheriff's investigators could be the cause. Oh, yes. No question about it. Full confession. Yes. Stephen Tapps and Nancy Garrido's attorney says the couple confessed earlier this month to the 1991 kidnapping of J.C. Dugard. Frankly, in a hope of mercy on the behalf of Mr. Garrido for Mrs. Garrido. Unfortunately, the quality of mercy is strained in El Dorado County. The DA's office is offering Nancy Garrido a deal for a prison sentence of 241 years to life. Philip Garrido's offer is more than 400 years in prison. But Tapson wants Nancy to serve only 20 to 30 years. He claims she, too, was manipulated by Philip. Based on what happened after all the stuff started to become the bizarre family, that she should be able to at least walk on the beach, uh, probably with a walker at some point in time before she dies. And you can't forgive people for things like that. But you News of a confession spread fast through Placerville. Many hope it means no trial for the couple and an end to the nightmare. It's probably the most horrible thing I've ever, ever heard of happening and so close to home and in our town. But the only opinion Stephen Tapson wants to hear is from JC herself. Does Nancy Garrido really deserve a lighter sentence? So, JC, give me a call. I'd like to talk to you if you would. It taps and says he hopes to talk with JC soon if uh, to ask her if 241 years is appropriate for Nancy Garrido. Tapson says that Nancy raised JC and delivered her children. The Garrido's back in court on March 17th to possibly enter a plea unless a plea deal is reached in the meantime. We're live in Placerville tonight. Cornell Bernard, News 10. Well, Cornell. from what we understand, JC didn't even want to meet Tapson when she had the opportunity, so he may get nothing in terms of a phone call. We will see what happens. All right, Cornell, thanks.